All right, going to show examples of Illuminati all-seeing eye of Horus symbol on movie posters, popular movie posters. So let's get right into the photos showing the Jesuit Illuminati, Jesuit ran Illuminati symbolism on these posters. Here's the first picture of Star Wars Episode Seven, the poster for Star Wars Episode Seven, showing the one the one-eyed symbolism, the all-seeing eye of Horus symbolism, right on the front cover, subliminally right there for your subconscious to see. Just how the Illuminati typically operates. They put things subconsciously so you don't pick it up, but your subconscious does. And they're doing it right here on the front of the Star Wars picture. Not to mention that Star Wars promotes Eastern mysticism and it promotes all this kind of uh, false enlightenment, this Luciferian false enlightenment, and it counterfeits a lot of the biblical stories. So not surprising the Illuminati are going to shove their symbolism into the front cover of the poster. Now here's the front cover of the poster for the movie Avatar. A very very popular movie. I remember the trailers for it being all over the place, uh, the posters being all over the place back when it came out in 2009. Uh, again, showing the all-seeing eye of Horus, the one-eyed symbolism, right on the front cover of the poster. And what's Avatar about? It's essentially about occultism and transhumanism, and um, you know, occultic AI type stuff. That's what Avatar is about. So again, it's not surprising the Illuminati are going to shove their symbolism into the front cover of this poster, which is essentially about occultism and transhumanism, a, f a form of transhumanism. You know, put uh, science fiction as well, the occult, has, the occult science fiction side too as well, of it. Here's a picture of the Transformers poster, again with the one-eyed symbolism of one of the characters looking over the planet Earth, almost symbolizing the Illuminati, the Jesuit ran Illuminati's control over the world, essentially. Of course, they're not more powerful than Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ runs everything. The heart, the, king, the heart of the king is in the hand of the king. The heart of the king is in the hand of the Lord. Uh, pull up the scripture on that. Yeah, Proverbs 21, verse 1. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. As the rivers of water, he turneth it whithersoever he will. So yeah, they're not, they're not more powerful than Jesus Christ. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. Plain and simple. Uh, that's Proverbs 21, verse 1. But uh, this poster is showing that right on the front cover, showing the subliminal Illuminati control over the world because they rely on subliminal messages. Uh, this is the poster of Godzilla, the movie Godzilla, with the all-seeing Illuminati, you know, you got the light in the middle of the eye and you got the one-eyed symbolism and you got again you got the Luciferian enlightenment right in the middle of the eye right there, the Luciferian false enlightenment right there. So again, as says size does matter on the poster. Well yeah, exactly. Again, it's more subliminal messages from the Illuminati on this poster. Godzilla, you know, God, the word God in there. Because the Illuminati essentially think they're gods. They think they're enlightened like gods, just like any Luciferian does. It's just the Luciferian false enlightenment being depicted here. And now here is a picture of the horror movie Chucky, Seed of Chucky, one of the sequels, I guess. Then you got the all-seeing, again, the one-eyed symbolism right in the front cover. Deliver us some evil. So then it has right there, you know, again, subliminal messages about the evil of the Illuminati. With the one-eyed symbolism, and it has the seed of Chucky, you know, kind of like the Illuminati being the seed of Satan, essentially, being children of the devil. Very, very subliminal tactics right there used by the Illuminati, right on the front cover of that movie poster. And these are just a few examples. There's plenty other examples of even lesser popular movies with the Illuminati one-eyed symbolism right on the front cover. Don't be deceived. This is how the Illuminati operates. They use subliminal messages to target the audiences of these popular movies. That's what the Illuminati does. They're very, very subtle and very, very sly and slit, just like any snake would. That's the Illuminati are. They're a bunch of snakes. And they're very sly and subtle about it. So don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.